Welcome to another RMS support tutorial. Today we'll demonstrate a new feature that allows a multi-part change request to be marked as a final part. Now let's get started. A change request is generated in anticipation of a potential or real modification to the contract. The process generates what is known as a basic change document or BCD. The BCD describes the change, the reason it is necessary, the initial estimated cost, and the time impact. The second part is creating a formal modification that may become part of the contract. A multi-part modification is used to get a contractor started with a not to exceed amount and a limited scope on an FFP contract since a contractor cannot expend funds on anything they did not bid. As work to complete and definitize the scope progresses, the final part closes out the modification by determining the best course of action to complete the project. Once that is finished, the multi-part change request is completed with the full scope derived from the findings. In this example, we will demonstrate how to mark a multi-part change request as the final part of proper procedure and documentation. For more information on how to complete a change request, please see the link in the description box below. To get started, navigate to the Finances tab, then click the Contract Changes module. Select the change request you wish to edit and double click to open the document. In the Inception tab, simply mark the Is the Final Part of a Multi-Part Change Request box and complete the modification as normal. Then click the Back button to save the changes. In summary, we demonstrated how to mark a multi-part change request as the final part. We hope you found this video informative and thank you for watching.